Hello guys, Barry here. Welcome to my channel. This time I'll show you one or two simple ways to make a time reverse with Unreal Engine 5. Open the third person character blueprint. I'll use a timer to stone the transformer and uh, data for the actors. Uh, it's not expensive uh, for GPU, CPU, or memories. And it also gives a good performance uh, of what we want. Add two new variables. Transform array. The integer. And set it to 5. I'm using an insert node to add a new item to array. But a add item to array is also okay. Get a length of array. If it's uh, greater than the counter, remove the last uh, transformer in the array. If you are using add item to array, you should not use uh, resize but uh, use the remove index 0. I'll call this event every second to stone the player's transform. Add another custom event. We will use it to do time reverse. If the counter license equals the array length, 
We will try to lerp the character transform and the transform in the array. When we call this event, don't forget to stop the timer. Oh, I found a small mistake. Let's fix it. I'm using a timer and a lerp to lerp the different uh, transform because I want to control speed easier. After the timeline finished for once, don't forget to increase the counter. After we set the of transforms reset the timer we can use a play rate node to control the reverse speed Let's have a look what we have done. It only works once. Let's find out what happened. Oh, I forgot to reset the counter. For me, it's perfect. That's all for today. In the next episode, I'll show you another way to make time reverse. It's a little different, something like uh, Overwatch Tracer's ability. See you next time.